Hello again, my fellow witches and wizards, and we're back in Grizzleheim, episode 16, but we're not in Grizzleheim right now, we're in Merle Ambrose's head, uh, quarters, I guess you could say, and, uh, he actually has to tell us something, so. I have troubling news from Grizzleheim. Ooh, really? It seems as if the cold day we feared has come to pass. Isn't that a good thing? Wait, what? old friend in Grizzleheim... Beyond oh, no. claws, sends word that the ravens of the coven have struck once again. Dear gosh. Beyond sent word to ask you to venture to Northgard in Grizzleheim and speak to him at your instructions. Okay. Where you may miss some class time. No, that's Ever fine. I never, I'm never in class anyway. I'm always out saving the world, Ambrose. It's okay. I'm always missing class. Oh, well. So... In this episode, we are actually starting Winter Tusk, which was the add-on part to Grizzleheim. It is a world just as... It's around the level as you would be in Dragonspire. I think it's like maybe Celestia kind of level, but, you know, it's, it's not that challenging. I, I could... You could say... I mean, I've not fit, done that. There's the phone. There's the phone. Okay. Going to Grizzleheim... The phone stills ringing. Thank you. It stopped. All right. So it looks like Bjorn Ironclaws has a needs to have a word with us. Oh, mana. Give me that mana. Yay, mana. Okay. Oh, look at all these people with the armament amendment pet. Okay. Oh, hello, Eric Weirdrune, and hello, Bjorn Ironclaws. What do you have to say? Forgive me. My gladness oh yeah, I'm glad to see you too. Oh, okay, talk right over me. All right, that's great. Your presence humbles me. Oh no, no, that's okay. The second greatest hero in Grizzleheim when you visit my world. Haha, <laughs> no, nah, nah, that's okay. I'm nothing that great. Times are grim. Though you defeated them before, the evil members of the Coven have struck again. Oh dear gosh, the Coven really? We fear that this is the final act of their terrible plan to curse the spiral with the dreaded Everwinter. Oh, not the Everwinter. King Belgar Goldenblade has need of your spell. Okay, I accidentally walked in there. No, okay, well, I'm gonna talk to him. How much? Like 630? Not bad. No, it's terrible. It's terrible for me. No. Ah, yes. Okay, hello, Valgard, my friend. What help do you need? As Bjorn Ironclaws told you, the evil ravens of the Coven are trying to bring the Everwinter upon Grizzleheim. I know, that those bastards, I'm right? Come on, let's go stop them. this dreadful cold comes, it will meet our world in ice. And the freeze will spread throughout the spiral. Oh, that's not good. Hello, Varric. Ice Fang. They crept from their hiding holes and struck again. Oh man, they, they need to learn how to stay in their hiding holes now, don't they? There is much to tell you, but still more that I do not know. Okay, where, where, where are they? Raffin Lorespeaker in Ravenscar wishes to speak with you. He knows more about the <gasps> Raffin! We get to go back and talk to Raffin, guys! Hey, it's all, it's our buddy, Hraffin. I love saying his name, Hraffin. Hwitens. It's like Hwitens, I say Hraffin. Hraffin, alright. Oh, Eric Wardrun, you have a quest now. I'm gonna accept that. Fjord is old. Oh, yeah. Hun Hendro Fjord. Yeah, he's basically the, the fine books in the Winter Tusk. So I'll, I'll, I'll take that quest. Definitely will take that quest. Hello, Huskarl. He Carl's. Uh, I just need to go talk to Hraffin, and I'll be back. Alright. Yay, Hraffin, it's been so long, and by long, I mean probably like a day. Hello, how you doing? I had better news for you, wizard. You're loud. The coven has returned. Oh, gosh. The same goal, the Everwinter. What's, what's their deal with the Everwinter, anyway? What if they you want it? Of the titans of storm, fire, and ice. Yeah, of course. I'm the I'm the student of the t storm titans. Before the spiral was made. Oh gosh. The ice titan sleeps deep beneath Grizzleheim, sent into a centuries-long slumber by Bartleby himself. Bartleby. Oh man, it's been a while since I've heard that name. Bartleby. <laughs> the coven would rouse the ice titan from that eternal rest. When he rises, his fury will be cold and fierce. Oh, well, we can't have that. The rules tell me that the coven is at work in Frundlefjord, 
a port in the part of Grizzleheim called Winter Tusk. Winter Tusk, okay. You must use your wits, your spells, and your courage to defeat the coven once more. Only you can do this deed. What kind of legs are those? <laughs> okay, that's good. Kind of, okay, I know. I speak to Valgard All right. once more. And tell him that Hrundlefjord is where you must go. Hrundlefjord? Hrundlefjord, that is where I must go. 1,200 12, experience for this? You gotta be kind of... Are you, are you kidding me? That's kind of a... It's just a talking quest, but you know. Okay, well, whatever. 1,000 experiences, 1,000 experience. That'll get me closer to leveling up. So, uh, hello, Valgar Golden Blade. Hrundlefjord, I must go. That's what Krafton said. Nice shield. I like the colors on it. Oh yeah, he did tell me a lot. Yay! Look at that experience. Yes, Hrundlefjord. Okay, why? Subjects. Oh, I wonder what kind of trouble. Okay. All right. Well. Hello, Varric Ice Fang. Not, not man, a man a few words, or a wolf a few words today, are you? Well, here we go, going off to Winter Tusk. Oh, excuse me, kind of burped again. Can't be burping. So we got to go and talk to Boulder Goldpaws. Oh, man, Boulder, I remember talking to you when I was, like, level 10 or something like that. It took me to Grizzleheim for the first time, and... Prospector Zeke has another search quest, so I'm gonna take that quest. The Trogs. How come your one eye is bigger than the other eye, but on your picture and your chat, they're like the same size? Yeah. Oh, Trogs. Find some trogs? I can find some trogs. Hello, Balder. Take me to Hrundlefjord. Oh, oh. I didn't need a step this instant. Okay. Thank you, sir. The music here is amazing. I wish you guys could hear it. Alright then, Balder. Long has it been. What's wrong, man? There is an unseasonable chill in the well, it's a cold area. And I have never seen a ship with such ice upon it. Oh, that ice? That ship? Stride over to that nearby ship and see what ails it as a cool Then, change. Huh. This ice is not natural. It was frozen in place here at the dock. Oh. Look at the crew, no less. They were frozen in their tracks. Powerful ice magic is at work here. Oh, no. Not the ice magic. I would like that one chest. Thank you. Yay. All right. Let's go past the campfire. 150 gold. Wow. Okay. There are others who could have done this, but I wager that the coven is behind. Yeah. Boulder is definitely the coven. Now what do we got to do? The docks can only be a sign of further mischief. Hmm. A foot? We can break off that dude's foot right there. Oh, uh, okay. Not open the gates or enter the village just yet. There may be trouble Oh, wow. It's all the troubles, really? Okay. A silver chest. Oh, my God. I actually love the music in this world. I really wish you guys could hear it. But you could always just go to Grizzleheim and those trumpet vines will play it for you. So, hello, Leaf. Oh, the gates are locked. Huh. The gates are closed and appear to be locked. Like Coven Rune Claws. Oh no. Leaf, what's going on, man? You gotta tell me. Frostbones, hello. Hello, sirs. Uh, Boulder. It says silence radiates from the village, but you know, it's like they're covering rune claws everywhere. The gates are locked, eh? That is a sure sign of trouble. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. What do we gotta do next to, to get in? The village guards would have seen the sails of my ship and opened the gate to greet us. Hmm. Well, I suspect that the village of Rundlefjord is in the icy clutches of evildoers. Well, that's not good at all. You gotta do something. Signal what? 
Oh, okay. Defeat some frostbones. All right, I can. I don't know how much health these guys have, so I'm gonna actually put in tempests instead of sirens. So let's do this. Oh god, these guys have a tower shield. All right, let, oh, let's do this anyway. So these are the frostbones, rank nine ice enemies with how much health? I don't know. One thousand seven hundred and fifteen. That's what it looks like. Oh dear. Well, we're gonna be f maybe fine. I gotta pass. I don't have a single blade. I swear, just the music here is amazing. That is Ice Blade, right, Frostbones? No, it's not an Ice Blade, it's a Tower Shield. Alright, I'm gonna have to hit you uh, with uh, just a slash, because I must do you justice for casting a Tower Shield. Hey, the gates look open. Can I just go on through? The gates are open. Can I just flee and come back and actually go through the gates? They're literally open. What the heck? <laughs> Okay, I guess it's uh, I'm gonna get the information just by fighting these guys then. That may be it. Who knows? Wow. 430, why would you want to use the nice Kraken on me, Frostbones? Here, you can have a Justice Slash. Yay. Huh, sorry, half of... Uh, I would've... Oh, well. Uh, math. Right, okay, let's get a Stormblade up. We'll use a Tempest next turn. What is this? Evil Snowman? No, it's Ice Trap. Why would you want to cast Evil Snowman? I mean... Evil Snowman not good enough. Alright, here we go. Stormblade. And he, right now, living at large with that temp. Don't you dare. Don't you dare, Frostbones. Okay, good. I don't care about Ice Blade. As long as it's not a tower shield, you're good. Ice Trap? Oh, well. You done, son. You, you done. Here we go. Tempest. What is this, like nine pip? Nine pips? Ten pips? You're dead anyway. One blade, one opportunity, 2,244 damage. Frostbones, you are done. Give me the information. I'm assuming... Oh, you're not... Whoop. Can I go into... Oh, oh, there's the gate. That's strange. Well, I'm going to be back after I collect that information that I need. So in a half sec. Hmm. It signaled its allies by bang... More of them bang their shields and reply. It is a code of some sort. What kind of code is that, Frostbones? You guys are not... Huh, I guess that's the best you guys can come up with for being undead and without a brain. They bang their swords upon their shields instead of speaking? Well, they're kind of dead. I don't think they... I don't even think they have a lower jaw. How could they speak? This is an ancient means of signal. Warriors of old call it Norse code. I see what you did there. Ah, Norse code. Morse code. Go and use Norse code to signal your way past the gate. The Bane hmm. of Rundle Fjord is named Vanir Storm. Storm Roar. If he lives, he will be in the village's hall. Why? Seek him out and return to me once you know his fate. Huh. And why is he, like, not helping out, huh? Why is he just letting these things kind of happen? Alright, let's use some Norse code. You tap on the gate a few times, and something that sounds like Norse code. <laughs> Something that sounds like it means it wasn't really. Alright, let's get in here. I'm going in. Yay, we're finally inside the... Oh, dear gosh. Is frozen solid. That is scary. That is scary. Put him by the fire. My god. Don't leave him here, guys. I mean, can we at least push him by the fire? I mean, I'm sure that'd help a little bit. Frost got, it's like everything here is like ice and oh there head hey dude I swear the frozen versions of these dudes look scary what am I caught on I actually want to find the trog I'm pretty sure the trog is like over here somewhere unless I'm crazy I might be just crazy no I guess not I think I know where it might be oh yeah I know where it might be I, it's just that you gotta go a separate way in order to actually get there so I'll do that later. But right now, we're just going to go back and talk to Boulder Gold. Hello. Can I talk to you, Leaf? Hello, Leaf. Were I in your boots, I would not enter that village. A curse has fallen upon it. A cold that consumes. Well, Leaf, you got to calm down. You know who you are speaking with? Probably not, because uh, you're probably like cut off from all of Grizzleheim. So, uh, hello, Boulder. He's frozen. You bring no news. Vanir alone can tell us what happened to Rumble. Yeah, I think the Trog's up there. Oh, yeah, he's frozen, though. A surprising way to thaw Vanir's Stormborn without harming him. This is Raven magic. 
We need a raven. Can we just push him by the fire? I remember rightly, an old crow named Morn Shadowbrew dwells in a small shack within her under fjord. Okay. Though she was wicked and unkind, she may be able to help us if she has not been turned to ice. Go she probably isn't. She Where is she? That's not navigation. Uh, there you are. Don't press the end button for navigation. It takes. It looks. Oh my God! All right. Um. Ooh, let's not get pulled. Did not see that. Uh, Morn Shadow Brew. Oh, not, wow! Look at that tree. Okay, you are in here. Hello, Coven Frostbeak. You guys are death enemies for some reason. Oh well. Switch up to my bundle of summer storms. Yay! Cause we're storming in the summer. It's actually very, very well fitting for what I'm doing right now. It's just like summer vacation for me. Who's this? You're not frozen. No matter. You'll join the others in their witchery do. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. Fight me. So this is Morn Shadowbrew, a rank 9 storm boss with 1,810 health and the Rune, C Coven Rune Claw, a rank 9 myth, with 1,265 health. I don't know if I'll be able to get away with using an empowerment and actually get in a plus off of it, but Morn had started off with 6 pips. Might as well. I'm going to try to... I gotta find the prisms. You, sir, will not cast be will not be casting earthquake at all. Thank you. You fizzled, Morn. Don't do that. Don't fizzle. Yeah, I should put that on you. Get rid of that. I almost got rid of the prism on accident. All right, let's use that. Uh, get rid of you sirens and some some sorts of spells like that. Oh, what is this? What is this? Mythblade, probably. Yeah, obviously, why wouldn't it be mythblade? Use like kraken. Or, not Tempest. Why Tempest? I don't get anything from a Tempest. You should have used the Kraken. Stormzilla, I wouldn't even be happy. I would have even have been happy with the... Ha happen. I would even be happy with the Triton. Alright, let's get a Blade up. Hopefully, I won't get Earthquaked. But even if we get Earthquaked, that should be fine. It doesn't really matter. It's not like I need the Blade or anything. What is this? Earthquake, yep, that's what I thought. Don't need the blade, though. I'm sure I'll be strong enough, unless I don't have enough pips. Well, there goes that. Thank you for the blade, though. Yeah, I don't think I'll need one. Um, I can do... Yeah, I'll boost on the room claw. Boost on... Yeah, I'm gonna use it. Alright, let's do this. Ha, let's do it! Sirens for the win! Right, you better plug your ears, Coven Room Claw, and more... Morn Shadowbeak? That's your name, right? Yeah, you guys are dead. Dead. So that's it. Done. Yep, that's right. No blades, 2400 damage. Look at that. Two more ravens added to my badge. Alright, boost on you. Yeah, you're done. Yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna help me, uh, you know, turn him back to... You're gonna help me thaw him? Ah, no more! I've had enough! I'll help you! Are you what really? You want? I want to thaw the dude. Put him by the fire. Go to the geysers at the edge of the village and collect some scalding water. Here's an urn you can use. Oh, I thank you. Pour it over Vanir. He should fall in a matter of moments. You have a quest? I could use your help. If those frost is you, nah, I'll, I'll take your quest later, sir. Morn. I'll carve you a nice runic shower. Huh, I didn't even realize. You, I didn't even know you had a quest. Oh, well, we'll do that quest later. Uh, we are actually gonna. Where are the guys? The guys are over here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Past the frost goblins. Uh, the one frost goblin, for whatever reason there is, there's only one. Cause uh, you know he's too good for for having friends. To collect the steaming geyser water. Yeah. yeah. Still only one frost goblin. Don't know why. Add some scrap iron. I'll take that. I don't know why, but you know scrap iron's always good. So now we gotta pour this hot water over Vanir. Okay, Vanir Stormer, how did you? How did you? How did you get frozen? Oh, there you go. There, uh, there he is. Oh, hello. Hello, Stormer. I was in my hall, ready to fight the Covenant, when I became quite cold. I remember no more. You are frozen. Now I am soaked and steaming. 
my state lacks dignity, but I am grateful to you for my freedom. It's weird, he actually looks like he's soaked. Oh my god, that, that artwork though. Alright! Don't know which one of these is the main quest, but you know, we'll take that next time. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video and the commentary in this video, please click that like button down below. If you're new to my channel, please consider clicking that subscribe button down below. I'll love a new addition to the storm, and here we start a Winter Tusk. We're going to be back with Winter Tusk tomorrow, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.